still going quackity 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 quackity. See him? There he is. You see him? Yep, I sure do. I'm gonna pick him. Bighorn? Yep. Where'd you go, pal? There he is. Great way to start off. Yep. I'm pretty sure I dropped him. I hear the wolves. Yep. You got the purple face today. <laughs> yeah, it's that it's that difference between the the launch version and the Steam version. Or are you playing on the Steam version? I'm playing on the Steam version. Yeah, that's funny how how it gives us purple face. But 60, I do believe I dropped him right over here. Sixty frames per second. I don't know what's wrong with Call in the Wild. Oh, it's just it hasn't been optimized. It's it's so brand new. I'm sure it's got to have just all kinds of dangly bits all over the place <laughs> must be because that that's i mean i knew and I, I was my biggest complaint when i did the survey i said you know the frame rates suck <laughs> yeah well i'm sure i'm sure it hasn't been optimized i'm sure it's got dangly bits all over the place but i'm i'm looking forward to seeing some video of it um i was gonna check out your 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 uh, videos earlier today and i had something come up but well, I really I didn't do get to do it. much. It was more or less learning how to do the controls more than anything else. Mm -hmm. yeah, Very dog, different. He's a, he's a pretty good looking fella. But now you see why I got it set on over here. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Yep, yeah, it was a, a gut shot because I couldn't see him. He, I knew he was behind the brush, but I figured I'd do a Hail Mary and see what happened. He's yeah. on 146. That's that's not bad that's, at all. That's healthy. Nice set yep. of horns. Yep, yep. All right. Well. Did you see right, my new you... toy? What's that? Here. Oh yeah. There you go. Are you sure you want to? Oh. That was not supposed to happen. <laughs> yeah, I think you touched pad maybe on. <laughs> Well, Poppy was jumping off the bed, which he's not supposed to do, and I accidentally brushed against it. Oh. <laughs> well, <laughs> we know it works. <laughs> it's like the spikes. Yep. What do we got here? Yeah, more big horn cheap tracks coming through here. But uh, are you sure you want to be in your uh, ghillie suit? I don't know. What's the best thing for here? Because that's what I... I purchase this because of this place well uh the ghillie the ghillie when you're sitting still is an absolute godsend but when you're on the move it makes an awful lot of noise mm. well what and if you're gonna wear the ghillie you also want to paint your face okay what what, um, what about the uh sneaky fall well so so the the sneaky autumn forest camo works in any of the forested areas here the uh the uh, field camo for Hirschfelden works in the fields here and the alpine camo works in the mountain areas here good god you have to keep changing clothes <laughs> yep so I usually wear the sneaky 3d uh, autumn forest camo and I just work the woods because I'm not much of a field hunter mm, okay so but I mean, you're you're more than welcome to to wear it. It's just it's it's kind of noisy, and with two of us moving around, it could it could make the difference, you know. Yeah, I know. I just kind of wish you had a camo that would work for the whole map, so to speak, <laughs> or at least be yeah. able to change when you're not near a tent. Yeah, need a re reversible jacket. That's what you need. Something like <laughs> that. Yeah, really. And my pa used to used to wear a vest that was camouflage on one side and bleeds orange on the other. Reversible one. Makes sense. Yeah. But uh, yeah, we'll head back out here, get a look at at our location. But um, since they've tweaked the bighorn populations, I've had many more bighorn over on this side of things than than I did previously. Oh, okay. Is, did they add more, or they just... Yeah, they uh, they increased their population a little bit. 
Uh -huh. But um, my my first hunt of the day, I took a, a nanny. She was right over there in front of the uh, the entrance to the tunnel. Yeah, this is about where I I am. Except I'm a little bit closer to the to the entrance. Yeah. Uh, other than that. Let me go ahead and change to that sneaky fall. Yeah, you know, I mean, I mean, if you really want to, uh, you know, the I'd, I'd suggest the, the sneaky uh, 3D forest camo, simply because the areas we're hunting are, are primarily forest. Um, let's see, are you wearing your field camo or your forest camo? Uh, wearing the forest. I don't it have like the you're field. In... Oh, okay, that sure looks... I don't know. I didn't. I didn't think we had a, a flappy hat for the. No, you're wearing field camo. Oh, I am. Hmm. Yep. You look like cornstalk. <laughs> yeah. This. Uh, this kind of. This makeup works pretty good. For this area. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It is the right color for the for the leaves. That's for sure. Let's go take a look down there where you've been camping out the new place. Alright. It's uh, the the tent. Well, you you know you know the location because I believe you have a tower down there. Yeah, I do. I'll be down <laughs> there in a second. Alright. Yep, and the wolves are here. They're already howling. I am on my way. Alright, you got your sense of suppression on. Heck yeah. Well, if we uh, ease our way on over to where the stand is, I think there's a good chance we're going to find out that there's a uh, carcass down on the shore. And basically, if I stick to the trees and you stick to the grass, we'll both be, both be camouflaged. Be more or less invisible. Yeah, when when it was just uh, Hirschfeld and for the autumn camo, I never had a reason to have more than one set of autumn autumn camo. So yeah, we've had some milk come through. Uh, Mr. Bear, where you is, Mr. Bear? Well, we've had a lot of activity. Up. We got uh, mule deer buck carrying on. We got a bear out there on the river's edge somewhere. We got wolves. We got a doe was carrying on so we've got the whole shebang here it's just a matter of whether or not we can manage to get any of them yeah so you put you put the um, tree stand yeah not too yeah, far from where I have the tower yeah. yeah you're a tree stand guy huh <laughs> yeah well that you know when we came in and hunted in the tower that's why i was telling you i i knew exactly where we were because this is where i had my two-man tree, tree stand set up yeah um, i need to set my i need to set my two man up somewhere but i haven't decided where just yet all right well uh you'll you'll end up in the left position which is actually the better of the two from the left position you got a really good clear view of the pond and the river the, the right hand one here it's not quite so good but as long as you're crouching and I'm standing you know the the views all right cool. but we had wolves right right down on the water here I'm not sure if they're still around or not um, yeah, I don't you know see with anything. with with you coming in and uh, loading your firearms and stuff there's a good chance they moved on but can't really see it from here but uh, the the to the left there on the shoreline very often is, is where one of the carcasses is located so I figured we'd hop up quick I just we'd get a look see if we had anything immediately out there and if not what I was gonna do was uh, hop down and just slip over and see if we got a carcass there or not okay if we do the wolves will definitely be through should I just stay um, here or you wanna... yeah, yeah go ahead and hang tight I'm just gonna gonna slip over well, and get a look at I dropped the patch and called from right here so that's where he'll come to if he comes in. Okay, but we've got, got, uh, got two bucks wandering around out there. Yeah, there's a little bushy thing right there. Yeah. 
but I don't <clears throat> see a carcass down on the shoreline this time around. Oh, that's weird. There must be one somewhere. Yeah, there's there's a couple of different places in in the general neighborhood here where I found them pretty regularly. But we yep. got a busy morning here. Is that a bear? Not about that. Well, he's probably where I can't get eyes on him because I don't I don't see a a bear. Yeah, it's a bear. He's just crossed the river. He's behind the rock right now. You should be able to see him now. It's a female. Oh, I got there. She is. Yep. She's just moseying on through. Oh wow, the movements mm -hmm. on them have improved. Yep. Yeah, and they sorted out the texture with them. They had they had done the new fur on them, and they had uh, used the wrong fur texture, and they looked like somebody crossed a bear with a pomeranian. They were just a uh, giant puffball. <laughs> Yeah, let's just let her be. She didn't hurt yep. anything. Yeah, if she came in closer, I'd, I'd take her with the recurve, but... I don't think she's, she's fine just, out there. She's just passing through. Yep. Yeah, I'd, I'd have a sweet shot on her. No doubt about that, but I'm going to let her be. Yeah. I told you there was a lot of grizzly bears through here. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, real regular. I'll I'll jump. I'll go up. I'll hunt the bighorn, and then I'll when I I'll jump to the tent. And when I jump to the tent, I'll have one real close by. I don't know what it is. I didn't. I didn't think it was supposed to be here, but well, I was wrong. Yeah, it's, it's the water. Yeah. yeah. Well, all right. Well, we've got. You got a doe working her way in. She's about 44 meters out, straight into the woods there. And the odds are real good that we got that buck working his way in too. <laughs> there she is. She kind of vanished for a moment there. Okay, I hear other footsteps somewhere. Yep. Wow, this is like active city. <laughs> and there's your buck. He is a good looking fella too. He's coming in from the left side. He's approaching the patch from the left. I see him. Well not He's now, a good He's behind the fella. post. Yeah. No, that's the dog. Yeah. No, the buck's the buck's right down there. Too bad that bear just stepped where I can't see her. I didn't try to take her with the bow. Nice shot. He's down. He's a good looking fella. Let's just uh, hang tight for a little bit. I'm sure the bear probably probably took off when that doe took off, but I'm not sure. I think I see her over there by that rock, but I'm Dude, there's something coming in on my right side. Do you hear it? Yep. I sure do. It is a wolf. Son it's coming in right below us. It's right on the other side of the foliage. Right straight down. I see him. Nice, nice shot. Did he run off? You know, that was really weird. I put it square in him right in the right spot, and it was almost like he vanished. That's what I thought. <laughs> it was, I was expecting him to either fall or haul ass, but he didn't do either. Yeah, yeah, I'm not sure what was up with that. Well, <laughs> I saw right, the let's... blood splatter. Yeah, yeah. The there was a hell of a blood blood patch. I I hit him heart lungs. Pretty damn sure, anyway. Hmm. You know? That's really strange. Yeah, it's that's kind of weird. Are you down there? Yep. 
Okay, I'm doing that. I'm coming down there. Well, apparently I'm not. I just switched over to the other side. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, well, he apparently ran, but that was weird because he he basically vanished. That's so strange. Thank you. Yeah. <coughs> but oh, yeah. What about a A point? Yeah. A's a 10 point. Yeah, 163. Very nice. Well, I I would swear I put that right square in his heart lungs, but it says body, so. But I got a good clear trail, so. I'm curious to see. Oh, there, yeah, there is actually there is a carcass on the beach here. Oh wow, that's close. Yeah, I was gonna say that that sounded like like he wasn't too far out. That was not my fella. No, no. But, oh, um, I, I hear something too. All right. Well, I'm far enough out that I shouldn't bother it at all. But yeah, yeah. See, there's a, a hell of <laughs> hell of a nice buck down over here. Uh, of course. Bull, bull elk. He has some pretty nice horns. Take a look here, see if I can see anything moving in towards you over there. I think I'm gonna get back up in the stand because I just heard that bear again. Yeah, you've got a, I'm gonna drop a dot on him. You've got a wolf. He's a nice one, he's a big old male. He's working his way up the shore away from you. Oh wow, he's in he the is woods. close. I have yep. no idea how to get him to come in though. Uh, without the collar, it's pretty tough. But uh, it's this this carcass that's pulling them over here. But this is this is the spot that I'm I'm usually finding carcasses over on this side of the beach. But okay. I'm try to figure out where in the world this fella run to. But so there he is. You see the wolf? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm body right lung, so that's kind of weird that it was giving me body blood, but he's a 15. As I always chap my behind. It's like, well, I, you know, I tried, decided I'd, I'd just for the fun of it, I'd do that, uh, that air rifle pheasant mission, you know. And the thing is, is that when you go to bring the air rifle up, it comes up so slow that is almost a pointless exercise. Any yeah. particular reason you're shooting me? Oh, <laughs> no. Just happened to be a, a bull elk walk right by. <laughs> oh, okay. Alright, gotcha, gotcha. Um, the, the female elk was just uh, just over from me and when you shot, she took off running. I thought you had shot at her. And I was like just up up the up into the, the hillside from her. And that's why I asked <laughs> if there's any reason you were shooting at me. Oh no. No, he he looked pretty nice. I can't I'm gonna go over here and see what he is. I started hearing footsteps and I looked over. He was ju he wasn't going to come in any closer. I wasn't sure I could get him with the crossbow because he might he might have been too far. That Weatherby took him down. Yeah. He went down instantly. Uh, let's see what he is. 181. Left lung, heart, right lung. Perfect shot. Been meaning to take another shot with my Weatherby anyway. Rather regal looking fellow. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. 
Olympics. Two kills so far. I would have rather taken him with the crossbow, but I just wouldn't. He would have been probably at the outer edge of its range. Yeah. Yeah, I keep losing that darn <laughs> uh, <coughs> er, sand. <laughs> there it is. I say it's it's uh it's a good spot, it blends in well. <laughs> 